Six out the first. Tidy effort, Glenn. Uh, first up from a break. Very hard to win, uh, particularly at Metropolitan level. And sitting three wide in the last lap, she's done a great job. Yeah, definitely. Uh, Short half head by two metres. Time 23.7. Uh, mile rate of 155.7. Last mile 156.3. And, and the last half mile like in 56.2. It. And all clear is now there. 11.641 on the first. She can be driven with the sit and use her speed. Well, it certainly looks promising for this campaign, doesn't it? The fact that she was outside her comfort zone. And she's always had that short, sharp burst right throughout her career, hasn't she? Uh, yeah, that's right. Um, David Lewis has done an absolute wonderful job with her. She's not the easiest horse to, to work with. And he had a, had a well, uh, well trained up when, uh, when Paddy took over. And Paddy's done a great job. He gave her a bit of a freshen up after her last campaign. And uh, she's come back a little bit stronger. And hopefully she can sort of stay up for a while. Yeah, 155.7, home in 27.7. Um, you know, the, the feature mares races doesn't, don't go that much quicker than that, so you know, there's a lot of feature mares races around for the season. Oh, yeah, let's we'll see how we go. Paddy will sit down with David and, and see what he wants to do with her, and um, she'll go to the breeding barn eventually, but uh, hopefully uh, we can keep her for a little bit longer and race her for a while. Well, she certainly is well-bred, and uh, I'm sure she'll be a very good dual-purpose mare. Jollibee Jagger scratched tonight. Was there a reason for that after his big win last week? Uh, yeah, he went good, pulled up good, but uh, just during the week he just got a little bit of a snotty nose, uh, just playing on the side of caution. OK, yes, well, I, I think uh, with a, a good horse like him, you, you do uh, go on the, the cautious side, don't you? Look after such, uh, you know, wonderful horses uh, for longevity. Yeah, that's right. Uh, if he doesn't make the end of the minion, it's not the end of the world. There's plenty of races during the summer that he can have a go at trying to race the good ones. Driving Cullen in the next, you're driving uh, for uh, Brad Hunt, uh, a bit of a drop back in class? Uh, yeah, yeah, I haven't actually looked at his form in Perth, but it hasn't been real flash, and you know, he's come back and they've freshened him up a little bit, and I don't know, it's back to claiming grade, you never know, hopefully he can uh, run a good race. Oh, he's a better horse than his form reads, I'll, I'll tell you that. Yeah, no, I still remember him a few years ago when I, he came up outside me in a, in a group one race, so... If you could get back to any of that, that uh, form, you'd be right. All right, well, thanks for your time, Glenn. That's uh, Glenn Craven, the driver of the first winner tonight, Mistress of Illusion.